Hello friends. All right, we're going to do our Sunday haul today because I'm just going to be honest with you guys. I did not feel like going out today. Um, my husband and I want to go out tonight and I just have like limited amounts of energy. So I really want to go out tonight and just have like a good time. And I just decided we'll just switch days. Today will be our haul day. I have enough for a haul. I don't need to go trapezing around and doing all these shoots. Tomorrow I will post two shoots. Maybe one. Depends where I go. If I get a really good shoot at one place, I'll go to one. But, um, and if you're new, welcome. Um, hope you enjoy the video and decide to stick around. Anyways, so let's get into the haul. I hope you guys are all enjoying the Dollar Tree one I posted. It's a good one. I mean, it was just like cha-ching everywhere I went. All right, this is a very rough draft. Very rough draft. I mean, if, well, I'm always honest with you guys. This is what I'm sitting in right now. I have a ton of stuff that I got to go through. Like to the left is Valentine's. That's got to go where more Easter is going to come out. Um, up in my closet, there is a ton of Easter. This is a very rough draft of what the tablescape may or may not look like. Um, so I decided to, I could not take the Valentine's scape anymore. I was just like, that's, it's, it's got to get off the table now. So, um, yeah. Oh, hold on. My husband's home. All right. Rough draft again. So I'm kind of liking what I see. I'm seeing where I'm going to tweak it. Um, I think what I'm going to do with this, see, this is a good deal. This is kind of like I'm getting two items for one price because I have the salt and pepper shakers up there because he needed a little something. And I don't, I do not have a wreath the size of that teal cake stand. So I just draped the Dollar Tree garland. It looks really cute. Um, and you guys know the camper and then we got like a whole bunch of Ray Dunn stuff going on. And then we got the little teapot right there. And I love this floral arrangement. Oh, Gosh, thank you so much for making it for me. I mean, honestly, I just am just, I'm just overwhelmed by all of your thoughtfulness. And I mean, you don't have to send me anything. And it's just so overwhelming by the generosity and the Tic Tacs, <laughs> you know, like, I mean, you guys are like amazing. And trust me, I don't expect anything, you know, I really, really don't. But it's just amazing to have such a great community. Um, Anyways, I'm thinking... I need to get some of the, like a little some of those eggs from the 99 the speckled ones and I think I'm gonna put two in there and just leave and, and use it like that or maybe go on a tear tray again I just wanted to get something kind of cutesy putsy for you guys to look at in the background and I just could not stomach the whole Valentine's Day thing anymore all right let's get into the haul all right we're gonna kick it off with Bath and Body um as you all know I ended up spending $107 there because I thought it was buy three, get three free. And then two days later, um, thanks to Kimberly, you know, she's on our Instagram and she's, and she's also in the comment section. So go ahead and post your, your, your YouTube link, Kimberly, if you're watching, go ahead and post it in the comment section. Um, and that way people can go check you out too. She had posted that Bath and Body literally not even 48 hours later was having the buy three get three free so I went back yes I did I went back and I went to the same bath and body and I was nice you know it wasn't mad or anything I just went back and said hey you know I want to return this I want to buy the same items back but I want to be able to get the buy three get three free so we did it now I, I now have a gift card for $30 so I still ended up spending you know what $78 there you know so, yeah so still a lot of money but Let's just get into it. All right. I like this because I feel like I can use this all summer and that can, you know, just last me until it's time to switch over into fall when I have to bring bust out the pumpkins in September. So that's going to be, and we like the nightlight in the master bedroom bathroom. So bought that and this was fourteen fifty. Then like, I just could not resist this. I just thought it was too stinking cute and I had to have it. And I know it's like, it, it doesn't even light up. $16.50. So I'm going to put this somewhere where I can enjoy it and see it. Probably in the foyer. And then these were only $8 the day I went. I don't know if they're still $8. Hop to it. I didn't even smell it. I just liked the 
whole look. And it's sweet carrot cake. So this may or may not go on a tiered tray. I'm not sure. As a matter of fact, let me smell it and I'll tell you all what it smells like. All right, I don't have like the best sniffer in town, but honestly, it smells like, I mean, they could smack snickerdoodle on it or sugar cookies and I'd be like, it smells good. It, it you know, it's it smells like cake batter or something sweet, something baking. Yeah, I mean, honestly, this is probably everything they didn't sell at Halloween that was this color and then they plastered that on it. It smells like some type of sugary item. It smells good, you know, no doubt. All right. Now... And honestly, I'm, I don't know when I'm going to visit Bath and Body Works again. Probably not till the fall. Because I really, I don't need any of this stuff. I mean, if you guys saw how much stuff I have. All right. I am just a sucker for the moisturizing body wash. I absolutely love it. Strawberry pound cake. I was like, let's do it. Um, then copper coconut sands. Oh, if... I would highly recommend if you like coconut and like you like that smell of summer, like suntan lotion, you'll like that scent in the spray. All right. Then I bought, I just bought this because I, you all know how much I love that Easter plaid. So I was like, ooh, this is cute. You know, tutti frutti candy. I haven't even smelled this. I've not even smelled it. Let's see what this thing smells like. I don't know. I guess it smells like fruit. I, can, I can't even tell. All right. Then... I bought me, did I get another lotion? Strawberry pound cake lotion. Why did I get so much lotion? All right. And then I don't even know why I bought this. Pear cream brulee. I guess because everyone's been ranting and raving about it. Like the YouTubers that I watch, the vloggers, they've been like, ooh, it smells so good. And I was like, you know, I got caught up in the heat of the moment. All right. And then I bought this. And again, no clue what this thing smells like. Why did I buy it? Because it says Happy Easter. And I was like all about that Easter plaid. And I was like, oh, how cute. You know, I can use this. Again, if I show you guys how many of these I have, you guys are going to be like, Crystal, <laughs> what are you even doing at Bath and Body? Which is true because I've got tons of this stuff. Tons of it. Um, fourteen fifty. And I got one item for free. Which one? I don't know. I think it was like probably the cheapest one over here. It was probably this one. How much are these? I don't even know how much stuff. Yeah, these are sixteen fifty now. How much is a moisturizing body wash? Thirteen fifty. So it's either it's probably one of these. I don't know. All right. So that's what I got. This was one hundred and seven dollars at Bath and Body. Yeah. But then I went back and got 30 bucks back, so. 127, I don't know. Oh, wait, wait, there's something in here. Oh, no, the candle. The candle. That place has to be raking in the money. That's what you get for 107. All right, quick question for you guys, because a lot of you are, a lot of you have, like, so many phenomenal ideas. I want to get lemon picks. Like, I want to make it seem like a lemon tree is coming out of that lemonade pitcher. Let me know where where I can get them from. Where I can purchase them from. Please. Thank you. All right. My husband brought me some beautiful flowers. I tried to arrange them. I'm better at arranging fake flowers because they're a lot easier than real flowers. But he got me the yellow because he knows I'm so into the yellow right now. And then red and white. Red and white roses. All right. These are Targ J Dollar Spot. Ray Dunny, Dollar Tree, the Garland. This is the Camper, Home Goods, I'm thinking. This, I think, like TJ Maxx or Home Goods. She's a cutie patootie. She's going to stay out until September. Um, The Ray Dunn stuff is probably Home Goods, one of those places. I love my little teapot. Thank you so much. It's, it's gorgeous. It's going to stay out till, I don't know, you'll stay out all year round. Um... And the basket I bought off of a friend that was bringing it back. Yeah. And then, you guys, I still can't... I mean, I haven't really looked hardcore, but this is going to be the runner that we're going to... That I'm going to have to use until I find the carrot one. But if, if I do find the carrot one, I'm just going to put it away for next year because I'm not taking all this stuff back and switching out. All right. Let's get into... Let's, let's do Taller Tree. All righty. All right. Oh, you know what? I have some speckled eggs. I can put that in there right now. Hold on. Just to be clear, I did buy these this week. So this is 
the first item. Twelve for a dollar twenty-five. Is it the best price? No, because we can get them cheaper at Walmart, Dollar General, and Family Dollar. All right, much better. I might try and tie like a little cute ribbon right there and i used green to kind of bounce off of the green leaves in that planter and just kind of give the and it bounce off of those little trees in the back just to kind of throw some other color up in this space all right i did buy these little baskets and oh one broke that's okay it'll still hang on the tree anyways i bought them to, as ornaments to hang on my tree yeah they're cute Cute, cute, cute. So, purchased four. Maybe I purchased more. I don't know. I gotta find the rest of all my... This better not be broken. Okay. I gotta find the rest of my Dollar Tree haul. Alright, four of those. And then I got these really cute cards, you guys. Oh. I think these are only a dollar. So, twenty. So they're still only a dollar. Happy Easter. How adorable is this? I'm thinking about sending this to either my niece or my nephew. I don't know. I like them both. And also, remember we talked about making little pictures... And using these, this would be really cute too. Sorry, I'm moving. All right, Happy Easter. Again, another really nice card for using as a picture. What are these, like four by six? Something like that. Easter wishes. Again, loving it. And this is so cool. Easter greetings. So anyways, this is for my sister and her family. So... I want to write my sister a special card just for her eyes only. So, grab those. And let me see what else I got from Dollar Tree. Alright, so, I'm missing one. I know, I know I'm missing one, but just imagine another one there. Okay, so I bought two of the bunnies and two of the teal ones. And I know I have some from last year. I know I do. They're here somewhere. So, I'm just going to buy a whole bunch of jelly beans. And fill them up. I love jelly beans. Ooh. You know, I just love jelly beans. Um, Adorable. Really, really cute. Oh, by the way, I looked these up because I used a picture from Mary Carey for um, thumbnail and I did credit it. And they're selling these for $11 plus shipping. 11 was the lowest one I saw and it's like $8.95 for shipping. I kid you not. All right. So that's that. And then you all know I went nuts for these. So I grabbed three. You guys, I need pot holders and uh, what are those things called? Oh, it's three and three of these. I think they're adorable. They're just perfect. I love these colors. You know, I think I need some more teal on this in, in here. I'm going to have to do something about that. I'm sure I have something teal. If not, I'll stick those on there. So, found the second one. Okay. Then I hit the jackpot. I mean, finally, up and down and everywhere and all around and yay. So, I picked up six. Because I'm feeling that dollar twenty-five just like the rest of you. So, I really, I don't know. Maybe I'll go back. You know, I'm sorry. If, if I see more, I'm buying it. Mm. Oh, I love this stuff, you guys. I mean... They stopped making the hairspray, and I kid you not, that hairspray was, I mean, that thing pumped up your hair. I don't know what it did. I don't know if it was steroids in there or how it pumped up your hair. You want big hair? Find this hairspray. I have not seen it in years, nor the um, shampoo. So I'm not sure what's going on with that company, but yeah, I cannot wait. I remember, like, this shampoo used to be really expensive, like $8.99, um... But I, yeah, so to get it for $1. twenty-five is still an absolute deal. All right, let's go in to Target. And sorry, I'm so disorganized right now, but in my defense, I'm transitioning the house. So, you know what, Target, I'm sorry, Walmart's right next to me. So we're going to do Walmart real quick. Okay. I got this bra, sports bra. Love the colors. Hot pink and black. Those are like my colors all the way. $4. It was originally $6.98. I took it. It's a size medium. I don't know why this particular one was only on clearance, but it was. They had like a whole bunch of these for regular price. Um, Then I decided to grab this. And this was 
This is a cute little tank top. Maybe I'll wear this tonight. I don't know. I don't know what I'm wearing tonight. But you guys will see. I'll do outfit of the night. All right. Then I need these. Like I need a whole. Well, I mean, I kind of do need them. All right. Some wax melts. These are 50 cents. And I don't know why they're still trying to sell all the fall scents and um, Halloween scents for like $2. It's like, are you serious? You guys are never going to get rid of this stuff. And I did price check it. It's coming. It's ringing up the right price. Anyways, this is 50 cents. This smells really good. This is um, Sensational's Iridescent. Oh, it smells good. God, it smells like a candy. And this one, I wanted to find this one again. This is Birchwood Bonfire. Oh. I didn't think I was like a Birchwood type of person, but maybe I am. I don't know. Very fragrant. I wish they made this like in a cologne. I'd get it for my husband. All right. That's what I bought at Walmart. Then we went to Dollar General. Oh, yeah. We went to Dollar General. When did I go to Dollar General? This past week. I'm positive. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, I'm running out of room on my table. I had to have this. Five dollars. I did show you guys this. This is not what I got this week at Dollar General. Hold on. I'm so sorry. All right. Dollar General. Okay. I picked up these. These are $2.66. $2 They're birthday cake bars by Pillsbury. I bought them for my husband. They're 50% off. Um, and July 2nd, no, yeah, July 2nd, 2022 is the expiration date. So I just picked up one of these. They, they looked good. And I mean, for what, like $1.33? Yeah. So basically what I used to buy as far as like granola bars and all that kind of stuff, breakfast bars, I'm getting at Dollar General because I no longer, well, A, the 99 doesn't have any food and B, how many times do I go to the 99? All right. Then I bought some of this grass. Great deal. This is by Peeps. Marshmallow scented Easter grass and I bought it in yellow because I needed me some yellow. And I honestly, you know, I'm not... Why spend a dollar twenty five if I can get it at the ninety nine cent store for ninety nine cents or Family Dollar for ninety nine cents, which I think I picked up three from Family Dollar or Dollar General for night for a dollar. So better deal there, and it's the smelly good stuff. All right, I bought this for the foyer table. Hold on, I did not go crazy at Dollar General. I've been trying to rein in the whole spending. All right. I bought this for our foyer table. This is our new key holder. You all know I'm just living the yellow life over here. That sounds wrong. All right. This is like a mustard yellow, but I'm still like, you know what? The reason why I can roll with this kind of yellow is because this can basically, this can get me through like Halloween and autumn. I can work this. So this is a good deal. And honestly, like what? $5? Yeah. All right. Then the Valentini 90% off. Like, are you serious? All right. This towel was originally $3. 90% off of $3. And I got two towels. These are so cute. Love it. Love the journey. Then I bought the gnome one. Happiness is gnome made. Of course, I drop it. Okay. Then the coffee one. How cute is this? You are the cream in my coffee. Adorable. Uh, yeah, I picked up two of the gnome is, hap is made and then two of the cream. So literally pennies on the dollar. Yep. 90% off. And I showed you all the stuff that was 90% off in that um, shop with me. And the reason why I didn't pick up more is because... I just, I don't have the room. I mean, we are literally bursting at the seams right now. I mean, all the stuff I showed you does not include what is up in my closet. Everything up in my closet is all Easter and spring. Yep. So I just was like, I wanted to buy more of everything, but I just couldn't. So anyways, these will be packed away and they'll be ready to come out for Valentine's Day next year. So I have some towels. All right, let me get this out of the way. 
Now let's do, let's see. Let's do Target. All right. I don't even know where this is going to go. Not a clue, but it's cute. $5, five stinking dollars. Love it. It's going to be, you know what? I didn't think of this, but this is going to be hard to put away because of those ears. But it's cute. I just love it. I think what I'm going to do is, um, you know what? Dollar Tree really, for like um, Valentine's Day, they didn't come out with the textiles. They didn't come out with, did they come out with the bows? I want like little Easter bows to put right here. Like put like one right there. Kind of like sideways. I want an Easter bow. To look like a hair bow. It's kind of right there. And also, let me know if you guys have seen any Peeps ribbon. Like the one I showed you. If you saw our Walmart shop with me, I showed a whole bunch of like hair bows and headbands. And it looked like they had like, it didn't look like. It was Peeps. The ribbon with the bunnies. That is stinking cute. It's like, um, hello, peeps. Sell that. I mean, crafters would love that. I mean, I would love to get my hands on rolls of that ribbon to make a wreath with. So let me know if you guys have seen it. All right. Pick that up at Target. And hold on. All right. So Fancy needed a basket. So I'm thinking... Hold on. I'm thinking the yellow grass would look cute in here for her. So mommy might use the yellow grass in there. Anyways, this is Fancy's little basket. Adorable. I think, I don't know where I, it's $5 or less, honestly. And I'm sorry if that crinkly noise gets to you guys. It's, I know it's annoying. It's $3, three stinking dollars. Now, think of how cute it is to give someone this basket. You know, you can use it with or without grass. You can use the towels, like how I rolled them up with those cute silicone ice trays and, or fill it up like with, you know, a cute big chocolate bunny, whatever you want. You already have the basket for $3. Build it from there. Throw in candy, you know, whatever you want to do or use it for decor. I mean, this could easily be taken apart and reused. I mean, look at it. There's a blank canvas for crafters right there. So for $3, yeah, I think it's a good deal. And it was fun. All right. I had to get this. Oh. <laughs> Queen? Yes, please, and thank you. This whole thing is a little stuffed animal. Look at it. Oh, I wish they had it in yellow. If they had it in yellow, I just would be... Well, I mean, I guess I can open it up now. It's mine. Look at the little peeps, how adorable. Yeah, I mean, you put in some yellow grass. And look how cute that would look. The yellow and the pink. I just love Easter colors. I really, really do. They are just so stinking cute. And they just brighten up a room. They really, really do. All right, that was $6. And I thought it was a good deal. Let me open it up and show you guys what this thing looks like. I'm kind of curious myself. Ta-da! All right, I just think it's cute. I mean, honestly, if you have a lot of nieces and nephews and you don't have time to be doing baskets and all that stuff, these are $6. You know, you get the cute little peeps. You get some marshmallow peeps. Not a bad deal. And I'm sure these are probably sold out really quick, too. But, um, ooh. That's going to be fun. Anyways, just a fun little deal. So I think this will go, like, on a tiered tray or something. But I had to have it because of the whole crown. I had to have these because I think I'm going to put them underneath my Easter tree. And I will film my tree before I take it down. Um, anyways, this is, is there, there's some kind of candy in there, like gummies or I don't know. Oh, jelly beans. Ooh, I like jelly beans. No, I don't want to eat jelly beans. Maybe I'll eat jelly beans. I don't know if I'll eat jelly beans. Okay. Um, anyways, this is going to be go underneath the Easter tree. So I thought those would look cute. Totally adorable. I don't even know how much these were. Let me tell you all. Uh, Hello Kitty, seven ninety eight. Oh, they're three ninety nine a piece. Okay, that was like seven ninety eight each. Um. Oh, sorry, you guys. Dollar General. I did get this. Cause those pennies on the dollar. How could I stop myself? Forty cents. Are you serious? Forty stinking cents at Dollar General. Yes, 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 yes. I think I spent $7 for all the towels. It's like 30 cents a towel. If it's 90% off $3, it has to be... What is that, babe? 30 cents? 
Ninety percent off three dollars. Okay. I think I don't know. Is it thirty cents? Uh, okay. Anyways, so I had to have this because I was like, this is too cute. It was originally four dollars, and I paid forty cents for it. I mean, look at that. Adorable. All right, that was Dollar General. Sorry about that, you guys. Anyways. Now, these are hot items, and I just happen to be there at the right time, you know? Look at these. How stinking cute. And I think I'm going to use a set on that bunny tray that I just showed you. This was at the dollar spot, and they were just putting this stuff out. $3. Like, are you serious? $3. This is, you could not buy each of these individually for $3 at Dollar Tree, and we know that. So I got one, two, three, four, five pieces for three dollars. All right, then, you guys, this thing is so cute. Look at that. Three dollars comes out to a dollar a piece. Bunny trail, egg hunt, bunny crossing, and you know I had to have that yellow and white gingham um, egg, and then the teal truck with all those beautiful pastel colors. Cuteness. Overloaded in cuteness. Oh, sorry, my, sorry about my Mountain Dew, but Crystal needs some energy. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, let's get into Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby went 40% off on their Easter stuff, so you know I showed up on Monday bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. All right, so the Easter grass at Hobby Lobby is $1.29 with 40% off. Which makes it, I bought two each, and those were $1.54. So $1.29 minus 52 cents. It's cheaper to get grass at Hobby Lobby than it is at Dollar Tree. Just putting that out there. So I picked up green and pink. Might pick up a couple more. Not sure. I'll have to see how I'm going to be using this stuff. I do have that pink cute crate that I got at Ross, so I think I'm going to need more, a lot more green grass. So I'm going to get it at Hobby Lobby. Um, if you want to get your grass at Hobby Lobby, I'd go now because um, with the $1.25 increase at Dollar Tree, a lot of people are now seriously price comparison. So they're not, you know, going to sit on grass that is 40% off a $1.29. So, yeah, I got to get there next week. What happened to her ear? Doesn't look like it's ripped. Oh, well. You know what? It is ripped, but I didn't notice it. But, eh, it looks like... You know what? I got to slap a bow on there. Okay. I won't notice it. All right. So, I picked this up for the bar area because I'm going to do a whole display. And you guys all know how much I love this Easter plaid. And, again, I was waiting for that 40%. I think there was maybe six or seven left. I mean, I'm sure they're going to get more shipments in, but I would not wait. I seriously would not wait. All right, let me see. How much did I pay for this? It's a 40% off. $8.99. $8.99. You got to love that. So, yeah. Very, very pretty. And then I'm thinking if I don't mess it up, or even if I do mess it up, I can always reverse it. So it should be fine. I want to reverse it because it's reversible. Say reversible stable runner for summer. Or maybe I'll use this side Easter plaid for Easter and then reverse it to this for summer. Something like that. But honestly, for summer, I usually do all red, white, and blue. Like the whole house goes patriotic. So we'll see. We'll see. All right. Next up, had this is what I this is why I went. I had to have this. This was $14.99. Spring Flower Market, $14.99. Love it. I already have the carrot one, so I didn't need that. This is this is what why it went. So it's going to look good. I mean, I'm, I'm seriously going to have a whole wall dedicated to Easter. Between that canvas, this, and all the rest of the Easter stuff that I've gotten over the years, it's going to be a really nice wall to look at. So i got to get... Tomorrow is when that's all going to go up. Remember the Easter doors? You know what I'm thinking, you guys? I'm thinking about putting those... <laughs> Hold on, I'll show you. Remember Family Dollar? I bought... You see, the Easter doors come in white and pink. Look, on either side of this. It's going to look cute. 
think I'm going to do that. It's either going to go on either side of the spring flower market or that carrot patch truck. That's what I've got in my head. So it's going to have to hang just right. So yeah, I'm, that's what I'm thinking. I was going to hang these in the foyer, like one above the other. But the more I thought about it, the more I said, no, this would look good with the spring doors. I mean, with, with the Easter doors on either side in pink and white, it'll just flow really, really nice. You know, I think I'm going to put it on this picture and leave the carrot one alone. So anyways, that's how I'm going to use them. And and I'll probably show you guys because Valentine's was is not like a... I mean, it's a big holiday because I make a big production of it, but I think I'll give you guys a tour, an Easter tour, so you guys can see all these months that I've been packing stuff away exactly how I incorporate it into my home. I've ordered these um, from Shein, and honestly, best place to get your earrings. Um, these are really cool little hoops. Maybe I'll wear them tonight. Not sure. I also got these little dangly hoops with the little rings around them. Maybe I'll wear those tonight. I don't know. Or these are really cute to wear tonight. And I also have a set of turquoise hoops that I ordered. Maybe I'll do that to kind of offset all the black. All right. I ordered a whole bunch of stuff from Shein, but honestly, you guys, it's the same stuff I get all the time. I get yoga pants and cute. I ordered, I ordered items thinking of hot spring and hot summer. I ordered lots of black yoga pants. I ordered like three pairs of yoga pants. And like four tops of yoga tops that are like cute to wear during the summer and it's all black so honestly trying to show it on camera is just it's hard all right tj maxx but i will show you the dress i got from tj maxx all right tj maxx i bought these sunglasses i wanted them bigger but these are pretty cool because my other ones i kind of messed up well, I, didn't, I mean i can still wear them but i wanted a new pair of sunglasses so got these these are i think steve yeah they're steve madden and they were 9.99 and I want a pair of leopard ones. So, all right, this next dress I got is by Calvin Klein. And I bought it because it's honestly, like I told my husband, 10 years from now, I can pull it out of the closet and it'll still be in style. It's just a classic look. Um, I, I have not loaded up our TJ Maxx video. I'm going to hold on to that uh, because I'm not, I don't think it's good enough to load up and Believe it or not, I know like this channel's a train wreck and I don't edit and things fly out of my mouth. Um, I'm very picky about what I will and will not load up onto the channel. Um, if I don't feel like a video is good enough to load, I will go to another TJ Maxx. And that's basically where I'm at right now with my TJ Maxx video. I need to hit another TJ Maxx to put the cherry on the cake for you all. It needs to be better. So I'm holding on to that video. Uh, but it'll be released tomorrow. So... Let me, because remember, I was planning on doing this haul tomorrow. I was not planning on doing it today. But I'll show you the dress. It's gorgeous. It was $29.99. And size 8, Calvin Klein. And it's just, it's a classic. I mean, it really, really is. Look at that bow tie. Look at that bow. It, I mean, it looks like... And then it's sexy because I like, I mean, I think this is sexy. It zips up the back with the gold and it's sleeveless and I'm going to take it to get dry cleaned. And it's just, it's very, very simple. You can wear it with black tights if you're wearing it in the winter, or you can wear it with a really cute pair of slingbacks, high heels, or a little heel slip on sandal for the summer and this is definitely a dress though you need your Spanx I mean unless you have like a perfect uncellulite body <laughs> which I do not have um so yeah I'm gonna be pulling on my Spanx you know I'm busting out my Spanx for this dress because it's just one you kind of pull yourself together and you know you definitely don't want any you you, you want a smooth line because it does hug the figure and the sale lady must have thought I was a nut nutcase. I thought I read a size 16 as a size 10 and I thought, you know, let me bring in a size 8 or a size 10 to try on. So I I I found out when I went into the dressing room that I brought in a size 16. And the lady must have been like, "What if she looked at me kind of strange like, "Lady, do you realize you're like jumping up eight sizes?" And needless to say, Crystal is not a size 16. Not that there's anything wrong with being a size 16, because been there, done that. 
Um, but it's a size eight, and this was originally eighty nine ninety eight, and I bought it for twenty nine ninety nine. So now, in my opinion, I think Calvin Klein runs big, so I'm pretty sure this is more like a ten. Probably in juniors, it would be considered a twelve or thirteen. That's me. Anyways, and I was thinking too that for a really chic look, these sunglasses would look cute. But at the same time, I'm kind of thinking leopard to throw off all that black. And like, look, these little, these earrings, those would look cool with some like leopard glasses. And I'm thinking about getting a cute pair of heels, open toed, maybe leopard. Maybe I'm going to do this whole leopard with the black. All right, my friends, I'm, I don't even know how long this haul is. And I am so sorry if you're new. Well, yeah, this is pretty much how the hauls go. Um, Anyway, thank you guys so much. You guys were really awesome. Again, um, your comments and everything are just so sweet and so nice. You guys are such an awesome crowd that, honestly, I don't, you know, I mean, yes, every YouTuber likes to see tons of views and have, you know, a lot of people watch them. But in this case, it really is quality over quantity because I'm really happy the fact that based on the amount of people that have hit that subscribe button, we really do draw in. We don't have any sleeping subscribers. <laughs> you know, I mean, you guys watch. You know, I mean, some of you watch every single video. Some of you drop in, you know, once a week, twice a week. But you watch. And that is so good as a creator to know that you're making content. People are actually, like, they're watching it. So I'm very thankful to each and every one of you. It's, it's very, very nice. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to go. I will see you later on tonight with Outfit of the Night. Have a wonderful day, a wonderful evening. Happy shopping. Get those deals. Let's have some fun. Thank you very much.